one good habit a day helps you to become a better version of yourself throughout your entire life. Have you ever wanted to achieve something great in your life? And you set some goals and put in a lot of efforts, your time, your commitment, just hoping to make your dreams become a reality. However, along the way, the results that you are getting is not ideal for you and you tend to feel frustrated, unmotivated, lack of discipline and decided to give up your goals. In the end, you will never ever achieve your goal. But do you know why? In this video, I'm going to share with you why the conventional wisdom of goal setting doesn't work and how to use a practical way to make sure you achieve those little milestones in your life. Let's begin right now. If you have read the book Atomic Habits by James Clear, he states that for conventional wisdom of goal setting, it seems to be not effective because when you set a goal in your life and you achieve it, it only changes your life for that moment of time and it is very difficult to keep up with that momentum to maintain your goal and as a result your motivation faded easily and it falls back to your old routine again so it's not about setting goals it's more about this important thing which is adopting good habits because by adopting good habits it helps you to keep up with that structure routine the momentum to help you achieve that progressive goals in your life. To adopt good habits, there are two important things that you need to keep in mind and that is design and integration. Now what do you mean by that is you need to design your environment and integrate certain processes, routine or systems to be part of your life so that you can keep out the momentum to achieve that little milestones and that matters because ultimately it's your daily habits that move you towards achieving your dream goal. There are four steps to use design and integration to adopt good habits in your daily life. Now the first way is set it. Second way is see it. Third way is share it. And the last way is feel it. Let me share with you my four steps routine of how I adopt good habits in my daily life. One of the key habits that I want to adopt in my daily life is to exercise regularly. For example, I'm using the first step, setting it up, is to write it down which day I want to go jogging. For example, Monday, Friday or Saturday. And at what time, so that it becomes very specific. And also, my favorite is to write it down on the phone using alarm to trigger, to remind me that on a specific day, at a specific time, I need to prepare myself to go jogging. And I find it super effective because it's all automatic. Step number two is to see it. Now how I use design and integration to be part of my routine is before the day I go jogging, usually I prepare my sports attire, which is my shirt, my shorts, my socks, or even placing running shoes that is somewhere prominent that I'm able to see it because I want to make it easy to spot, make it obvious so that wherever I wake up, I see it, I dress up, then I go for jogging. And that is how I design the environment and make it prominent for me to prepare for my routine. The third step is share it. Now, why is this so important? It's because you need to find someone who hold you accountable to make sure you complete that task daily so that you can achieve that milestones progressively. Now, for example, in my case, let's say if I want to go jogging on that day, I will ask my spouse to hold me accountable to make sure I dress up and go for a jog. And if I never do that because I procrastinate, maybe I'll need to treat her something or maybe giving her some money as a form of punishment to remind myself that I need to do that task on that day. And that is how I do it. Let me wrap up the last step, which is feel it. Now, in order to achieve success in this step, you need to have two important things, which is your identity and reward. When it comes to identity, in my case, 
For example, why I want to exercise regularly? Because my identity is I want to become a healthy person. That is my identity. And when you feel good about after exercise, you feel that oh, you are doing a good job, you are becoming more and more healthier each day. That motivates me to repeat that daily habits again. And the second point is the reward. I can integrate the reward into part of my habits. For example, like after I done with my jogging, I will reward myself to watch a movie, to eat something that I like, to buy something that I like. So all these are positive reinforcements to motivate you to do your daily habits so that you can reach your milestones. And that is how I adopt it in my life. I hope this gives you clarity of how you can achieve your milestones by adopting good habits in your daily life. Because in order to have success to achieve your goal, you need to start to design your environment and integrate certain processes, routines or systems into your life. And that's form good habits. You need to start to adopting these habits to track, monitor your progressive goals and eventually you will reach your ultimate goal. And let's say if you enjoyed this video, please do remember to click on the subscribe button below, turn on the notification bell and leave me a comment. Is it useful for you? Is it able to help you to really think through that conventional wisdom of goal settings may not be effective for you and how you can use these daily habits to start forming routine, structure, to achieve little milestones in your life. And that's all for now, and I'll see you in my next video.